Hey everyone, Allie here, welcome back to the channel. So I've been having some success with Nehemiah uh, on Ladder and so I thought that I would showcase a couple of my games uh, with this deck. So I hope you guys enjoy watching and thank you so much for subscribing to the channel if you are subbed. Doggo walked in and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. I made it to le oh you made it to legend last year uh, and lost a lot of money in poker today. Okay, nice. The card games are still strong with this one. Well, then you should give parallel a try. It's um, yeah, you might really like it. Uh, okay, we're opponent is going first. Do I even keep that or do I just go for the steward? Honestly, if they're going first. This is I probably need to find spores. Surely I will. Hey, I think you'd like it. All right, I think this is probably too slow. Surely. But I guess I could have banked the other steward instead of giving up the guys just in case. Yeah, do you play poker online or live? I yeah, I, I played some Ultimate Texas Hold'em in Vegas, and I might play some at TwitchCon next weekend. I'm too nervous to play against real people in casinos. But that's because I'm not very experienced when it comes to poker. In another Time to strike. Did someone say TwitchCon? Jason's here. What's up, Jason? Yes, I'm very excited. Uh, okay, so they killed my thing. Does that mean I should just play a Mizra? Or do we want to play another steward so that I have the option of playing Nehemiah next turn? Because if I don't get this down, then I'm going to go here? That's actually just all kinds of awkward. Maybe I do just actually go for a steward again. Bank this. But it, it feels clean to do this, and the next turn I would go here and here. I feel like this is pretty important. If they can't answer this, I get to go Nehemiah, and then they have to deal with a whole, whole ass Nehemiah. Wow, this might be super wrong, alright? Might be super wrong. But we're gonna attempt we're just gonna see how this line goes instead of playing that. I guess I like playing the Nehemiah because it's a giant defender, so it like takes off their assault stuff unless they have like pings, you know, or crack shots and shit like that to the face. And then if I can get her down before Lemieux is, they went first, right? So like I play Nehemiah on four, then they just Lemieux her on five. Like maybe I get a turn actually like actually using her before she just gets Lemieux. Texas is the new gambling capital of the world. Poker in Vegas is overrated. Uh. I, I'm totally ignorant on the gambling laws in Texas, but do they, can you gamble in Texas like you can in Vegas? For what it's worth, I'm pretty sure you'd beat up on players in Vegas. Maybe, maybe, but I, I really am. For being a TCG player, I never got super into poker, but there is a good chance that at some point in my life, I move to Vegas and then I start the poker saga of my life. Uh, okay, so they got to play their longbow carrier, which feels Batman. It feels a bit Batman, but that's okay. Let's see Ali's poker face. Honestly, it just sounds like fun. Like, I've, I don't know. Like, you get to, like, try out your acting skills. And, sorry, I just feel like there's something potentially very cathartic about, like, me, me like, looking like a little grill, potentially tilting grown-ass men playing poker. Just... It would be fascinating if I could actually do that. <laughs> you get nervous? I'd probably get nervous too. I'd probably, uh, yeah, crack under pressure. It's a gray area. Poker clubs are legal. Oh, Nicola Gay gifts us up to friends. Thank you, Nicola Gay. Online poker sucks because there's way too many Qatar princes going super high risk. Fair. I remember you. Oh, that's terrifying. All right, we're effed. <laughs> Time to strike. Do not know how I'm gonna answer these things. <laughs> At least I can answer the longbow. I mean, spores would have to heal God. I could heal it, that's interesting. But I have no way to get through this O4. Oh my God, I've got a black market fixer in my hand. Brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Damn. Okay, well, I can't just heal this up, right? Because they'll just Lemieux it down, right? So I should probably take the opportunity to actually, like, cl clear this thing. Oh, God. Is there a better play? Like, I can't play this. Can't give this defender, unfortunately. Oh, I can! Oh, my God! Oh, I can still only do the thing. 
That's fine. That's fine. That's great. I'm so happy I saw that. Jesus. Uh, okay. So we can go here. <clears throat> and I go there. And I trade what? And pl play what? The This? Thank God I saw that. Lolol. Zolol. <clears throat> Nehemiah basically inner for Hearthstone people, she basically inner fires the board, right? If for the units that have defender and the little uh upgrade that I played on my 04 gives it defender. So it was an 04 and then we buffed it to a 77. And now we have a remaining uh, black market fixer to answer this. When will you challenge Force in Alley? You need to beat his speedrun record in what? Oh, in Minecraft? I have actually never played Minecraft. And I'm really sad that I missed out on that because I would have loved that shit growing up. Like, Minecraft would have been my jam 100%. Uh, I guess I accept this here to like actually get value out of the damage. I mean, I guess I kill my thing, but like now this is a three three. Yeah, I'm 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 pretty sad that I missed out on Minecraft, but uh, whatever. It might not be too late for me, though. You like Stardew? I I feel like though I'm a I get a little bit more like antsy in those like chill games like you know when COVID happened I started playing Animal Crossing and that was a good time but it only like held my attention I feel like I've just played strategy TCGs like too long and that now I get I'm like if I'm not like competitive of like climbing a ladder or something I get a bit antsy I could play Solia and take that trade I like that more than Black Market Fixer but what am I doing next turn like this and this so Lydia is really cool. She's a legendary. Um, if no combat damage was dealt, she at the end of the turn gets to pick a minion. So I'm going to pick herself and she gets to fight something, has first strike and also gets through defender. So we got to take that out. But like I said, I didn't I did enjoy uh, Animal Crossing for it was, it was very cozy and I do eventually plan to finish Skyrim. I was enjoying Skyrim quite a bit. I've honestly been feeling the need to play another Resident Evil. I played the remake of Resident Evil 2 and I loved that experience. I thought that was great. And it's spooky season, so. But there's a very small sliver of time where we're, I'll still be home, not traveling. Resident Evil for Halloween. <sighs> uh, do I let that attack happen or just ha trade here and then give that defender? Uh... I feel like keeping her alive. I'm a little sad that I gave up my crew boss, actually. Because then I could have buffed this to a 5-5 five, five and taken that out. Fuck. Hmm. Okay, yeah, that's why, right? Because they were going to kill her, the remaining. Well, that 2-5 can't attack. I could heal it up. Uh... So she gets to attack, but do they still attack back at games armed and evasive? Yes. So like it would still attack back, but then it would die. How does that work actually? Okay, like I want to go here. I don't know, Kev. I don't know Kev either. Gentle touch. Like I'm not gonna do. And should I just play that as an extra one one? Swiftly now. To make that a 4-4? Four, four? I guess so. It's an extra defender unit, too. Okay, shall we science? I don't know how this works. Oh, I guess I... Yeah, is she's gonna die? Maybe I... Well, maybe I pass. She definitely dies. She attacks it first, and then it'll attack it back, and they'll both die. That's definitely how that works, right? Yeah, it's like... Armed is like first strike, so she'll get the first attack in, and she only doesn't take. Di oh no! Yeah, no, that's that's. Or she would have only taken two. She gets the first attack in. I actually don't know how this works. I thought she would get the attack. It would take two, and then it would attack. But it can't attack though. You may pick a friendly unit to attack an enemy unit of your choice. Ali, no, it's it's more just like a interaction thing. I actually think I could have attacked it down, and maybe it doesn't attack back. Maybe they never attack back. Actually, 
and she just gets to like do a little snipey snipey. No, they're if they're always attacking, they're taking damage. No, 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 that doesn't make sense. Okay, sorry, I'm I'm <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Uh, but what we can do here is, I think at this point we don't need the spores. Is that crazy town? Maybe. And then I could go here, and then here. Unless I'm committing way too much into their like shadow flame thing. I am called upon. Yeah, I could trade there, or I could do nothing and have this five five fight this two five. But then they could trade there, but I could block. So if they did have a Shadow Simply Flame, this now. would not get answered. But I could still do that. I should probably just get seven damage into the face, right? Uh, never mind. Obviously. Do I want to kill that? Sure. No room for better judgment. <gasps> Simply a mystery. This sneaky little one one, I didn't see it glowing because it's already glowing. We missed a damage. So sad. For business. So sad. Yeah, on the on the interaction between the Solia and the two five, the, I'm pretty sure she the four four would attack the two five, but then she would take the damage back. But the thing is, is like it's a unique case because that wall can't attack. I don't know, like if the fighting each other, like she still would have taken the two damage because like it wouldn't have been like a clean kill. But I actually don't know. <laughs> Wow. Okay. Well, I said it. Was that a six six or a seven seven? Can't remember. You're expecting a fur fight? You're wrong. Yeah, it was six, right? Well, at least I didn't throw the Mizra and the thing into it. I was definitely right to ex anticipate that. Hi, Willow. What's up? Get out of Should I bank my spores or is that crazy town? Because like spores is super good. Uh, what's better, spores or tutus? I mean, tutus could just kill them next turn. All right. I think we gotta keep cycling through. Hi, Willow. Did nobody feed you? That's just so rude. I mean, you're not. She's not panicking too much. Okay. Oh, there she is. Hey, did anybody feed Willow? Uh, that would be really helpful. Uh, I bought her, her- Oh! Um. I got her the- her old, um, tuna Stand can. Proud, Marcolians. I might very much regret giving up the spores, I'm Stand not gonna lie. Proud, Marcolians. <laughs> Guard duty. Okay. Well, if I use the four, the two twos to kill the wall, probably should use the two twos to kill the wall. Oh my god, I gave up two spores? Jeez. I mean, I just had board presence for so long. Yeah, they. Marco has that card that deal, dealt damage to the board. It's like a uh, shadow flame. Targeted a uh, Wong. Finally action. I mean, as long as they don't have another way to do. Damage to the board. I could also just use the black market fixer here. Keep banking that. I don't know, Kev. I don't know, Kev. It's okay, Ripa. You don't have to know. But seriously though, if you're still in the if you're still in the card game frame of mind, you should give Parallel a shot. What else is going on in your life? Uh, Ripa, anything new and exciting? Mm -hmm. Did you see Fabi got married? Fabi had such a beautiful wedding too. I don't know if you follow him on uh, Instagram, but it was it was so beautiful. I saw Defaz. Uh, Mason and I went and got uh, dinner with Defaz the other day. He was in LA. He's all grown up too. It's crazy, I've been streaming for like seven and a half years, so there are some people that have been watching my streams since like the time they were like still in high school, went to college, graduated, and now are like going out into the world. Baby, yeah, Faba maybe. All right, so we still have a crew boss. 
What the fuck? Wait, what? Uh, how much damage do we have? We have 5 plus 6 is 11. Do I really want to be throwing these away? I haven't heard of anything from for 5 to 6 years. Yeah, Fabi got married. All right. Go here to make this bigger or get an extra damage in face. Honestly, we're so close. Maybe we just go all face and say screw it. F your 1-1. One, one. I have Defender anyway, right? I think I'm... Yeah, we need to hold that back. How do you know? I follow him on Instagram. I fo Ali follows all of her viewers on Instagram. That's true. <laughs> um, but Nick told me... Yeah, Artillery Volley. Destroy target friendly unit, deal damage equal to that unit's attack to all enemy units. That's the, like, Shadow Flame Shadow card. Triumph. All right, now we need to get the longbow going. We have lethal as long as they don't play another defender. Oh my god. Son of a bitch. What the fuck, Ali, you don't follow me on Insta. Do you even use Instagram? I'm gonna need to improvise. I guess I just spores, huh? Even though I'm gonna kill my own board, at least they're gonna, these will die and then they'll start popping up two twos. Does that make sense? Or not? Like we kill that, I play spores. It answers their whole board. It also kills our board though, but then my three five will, will live and then that would just be lethal because it'd go four to attack plus the six, as long as they don't ha have another. Um, sure, that's fine. As long as they don't have another yeah. and you won't even know Good stuff. Here. Moved to New York City a couple months ago. So much going on. Uh, we'll Let's probably just go. chill until set 10. Uh wow. What um where did you live beforehand? Like was that a big move? And if so, are you, well, are you liking New York City as well? Uh all right. So obviously we're going to play that. What do we want to bank? This maybe? How bountiful. I'm actually really curious to know if you like living in New York City because I, we talked about it earlier today, I just don't, I don't know. I don't know if I'd like New York City to, to live long term. Like, I like visiting, but I don't know. All right, so we could play a 3-3 three, three with shielded, meaning they'd have to... Well, they could play a relic and then just trade into the 3-3. Three, three. I could bank one of these and then heal up, uh, this up, and then that it would still live, perhaps. I would really like to be able to play my Nehemiah next turn, so if this lives, it'll keep us ramped. Bank one of these? I don't- I'd almost rather not bank these and just bank a Spores. Am I really gonna need a Spores against- <sighs> It's like I might. I might. I think we just play this. Upon. And right now, okay. I was living in Michigan, just working remotely, but work made uh made us all start coming in again. Okay, got it. I've been really enjoying it though. Awesome. I stand watch. Okay, I life siphon. Or no, that's gonna get banished. That feels bad. But if my steward lives, I can play black market fixer Let's on that next turn. Just don't life don't have a life siphon too. Don't have it all. Have it all. It's like Okay. What do we want to bank? Kinda like these. They do get black market fixered, but that's really the only great target to it. This is just value. I love this card. This card reminds me of Earth and Ring Farseer in Hearthstone. I think I'm gonna give up the spores. I'm gonna do it. So yeah, if we could like play a 6-6 six, six or something that could cleanly kill the brand, that would be cool. All right. So I could play a 4-4, four, four, bang something and play a 4-4, four, four, which would be able to kill that 4 or if they don't have a... Oh, sorry, I guess they could always uh, honor steward this as well. It's black market fixer and that. 
I also could just play a 7-7, play Nehemiah here. If they have a an erasure, I'm gonna be upset though. The other option is to get this going, but I feel like that's kind of weak right now. This is pretty nice. Swiftly now. I guess how I feel is that if I play a 4-4 now. Like, and then they play Brand next turn, then I could maybe, like, play my Nehemiah into their... Actually, maybe not. Because if I play my Nehemiah, they're never going to play their Brand into my Nehemiah. They'd have to have an answer to her. Watch. I mean, shit, if you're using an Erasure on my Tutu, I'm, like, not that mad. So if I kill this... And then I get my little mana dork back, and I could bang something and actually drop a 6-6. Six, six. But it's really bad if it gets answered. Their option is to just take this trade, which is probably what I should do. And then I could heal this back up. Kind of nice. That's all I'm doing for the turn, though. Maybe I should just drop Nehemiah. And then trade, because they just used an erasure. Question is, should I just say F everything and go for a Gaia's call? Because I could probably just win on a Gaia's call. Swiftly now. Witness Crimea. Oh fuck. Forgot about that little detail. It's fine, I can block it. I don't know. That's a really tough one. Because I super, super liked the value of healing up this minion after the trade. But it, it, it's the fact that I was only using three mana on my five mana turn that I just didn't, I just didn't like. I mean, this worked out great. I'm super happy with that. Used an erasure and then I still got to kill that off and get my thing back. I am not mad. Should we just Wong? Kind of a full hand. Sort of either want to get... Should I just go for my guys and see before? Because they only have one card. Maybe they. Do, maybe we just go here and we start banking some... Mm. I don't even have that many things, though, in my guys, which is a little concerning. Maybe I bank this. Uh, but then I want to get this down, but then it's like really bad if they find, if they wind up having now. EMP. Fuck it, should we just play a 3-3 three, three, then? Sure. You like Gaia's? I like Gaia's here too. Okay. If they banish their own brand... The aftermath does not get triggered, right? So if they were to play Demolecularize on this board, I wouldn't have to deal with the 4-4. Four, four. Because I kind of just want to go like Shoshana into Wong, see what happens. I guess maybe I Wong... F well, I guess I wouldn't get the buff here. Maybe I just Wong first and see what happens. Then maybe I could take a clean trade. Uh, sure, we'll take that, we'll take that, we'll take Tane, we'll bank Tane. Oh fuck, I am probably gonna burn... <laughs> Swiftly now. Witness Primea. Hey, okay, cool. We're not burning. Shame that we couldn't cleanly clear that four six, but there you are. Ah, <gasps> son of a beach. Actually, wait, why did I do that? I kind of forgot that that gets banished. Should have just let that die, right? Instead of the, my 5, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Fuck. Uh, we might... Okay, we have two formidable presents. Is 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. We just have lethal. Witness Primea. Like, never let a... Uh... It called Let Brand live that long. Uh -huh. 
I also had the formidable presence plus this the following turn too. Nice. Okay. Well, being shrouded two times in a row with Nehemiah feels good, man. You just have it bookmarked. You have my. <laughs> Actually, okay, there's this whole here. video of, it's really funny, Standing with the spider by. incident, there was a tarantula at our house, okay, for those listening that don't know, well, let me just, opponent goes first, one sec, do I keep that, I feel like that's too slow in the beginning, actually, I don't know, is that too slow, eh, probably, um, there's this really funny video of, Mason micromanaging me catching the tarantula. It's super funny because it's like, it's just like he doesn't clearly want to be getting the spider. And he's like, you gotta, you gotta do this as I'm like getting the spider. It's super funny. I really need to upload that to TikTok. Like I never upload to TikTok, but um, I feel like the internet would find it very, very funny. Meta won't comply to EU rules. Really? That's why. Interesting. And it is spooky season, so maybe I need to do- I need to do that. Wow. Okay, this game might be... Time to over. The ah! I don't know, all we need is a spores, right? And we can get there? Ooh, I just got hit with a wave of hunger. So what do we bank? I feel like I don't want to bank this because it's a defendered unit, right? Good against aggro. This heals me if I've got a wide board, which is like a kind of conditional thing, and I'm not really willing to give up a turn, like my turn three. And this can answer this if things go south, and this is also an answer, so I guess it's gotta be that. Time to seek sustenance, eventually. Let's see, it's 4.41. Yeah, sustenance sounds real nice. I did eat two English muffins today, though. Back to back, I was just like, fuck it. Time to I'm strike. hungry. <laughs> LBC, All in. right. Um. The banner. Usually I make a breakfast sandwich out of it, like I have egg and cheese and stuff, and today I was just like, nope, I'm just gonna... Butter and honey. Uh, two whole muffins. Yep, two whole muffins. All right, so we can drop the Nehemiah. That's the turn before they're able to play their Lemieux, which can just destroy a single unit, so... Is that the move? Or... I mean, I don't really see a better play. God, it's like, if for whatever reason they don't trade everything into her, keeping this to heal her back up would be really nice, but then I guess... They'd probably just Lemieux her down. So what do I give up? They have a target for this. Maybe this is just too slow right now? Okay. A two whole muffins. Baby was one time even in Munich at Oktoberfest and he didn't want to meet with me. Well, did he like really not want to meet with you or was he just, you know, life is busy or, um, and also maybe sometimes, well, I'm sorry about that. I'm not trying to make excuses for him. <laughs> sorry. Been there. Okay. Done that. If he was like, no, then that feels bad, I suppose. Jimmy's here too. Oh, friends, you and Rippa met up together? Wow. Okay, so... Five mana. I think we want to get the Solia out and make that and bonk there. Oh, that means that I can't kill that, though. But then he's forced to, like, make an awkward decision if he does want a Lemieux next turn. Like, which one to kill? Oh my god, that's kind of a tough... The other play is to, like... Malachite shield, trade there, trade there, but that's all I can do with the turn, which I, that's why I don't like that. It's like I could black market fixer, this, trade there. I could also get Jonah down and take that trade. I think it's this. Be one thing if I had six mana this Swiftly turn. Now. Am I really not making that attack though? Oy, oy, oy. I have learned. And now, so will you. Judgment. So now we still have a, a defender unit in the way. So basically Lemieux gets to destroy a unit, put something from the waste into your hand, and friendly units get plus one, plus one that turn. But in order to do all three of those, they need to damage my face first and trigger assault. 
Ha <laughs> ha! Unlucky. Um, so that th card deals one damage to a random enemy when it's banked. So if it hit face, that would have been unfortunate for us. So with this play, both of these are threats, obviously. So at least he's just using the destroy, like, one of the abilities here. Um, and then, like, there were two threats to choose from, so I feel like I like this, but... Oh, this is gonna be fun. So we can heal her up to a 4-4 four, four again, and then at the end of the turn use her ability to snipe that down. I also don't have to heal her up, I guess technically, because she'll get first strike and kill that, but I think I like doing that. So I have, oh, I actually only have five mana this turn. Never mind. Hmm. I don't know what I want to give up. I guess maybe that. Do no harm. Gentle touch. Dude, I love Celia. Okay. It's annoying to not be like take that trade because just the O4 is a little annoying to get through sometimes, but it's much better to take that thing out, I think. Obviously that thing could have been black market fixer. What the fuck is that? I sometimes I forget some what is this? Oh yeah, they fight each other. Okay. Yo, Marco is just insane. It's like the aggro class that has it's got board clears, it's got card draw. I I actually I have decided that Marco is the druid. You know how a druid just seems to have everything in Hearthstone? I guess maybe not. But like they've got ramp, they get card draw, they get health. I guess they don't usually have good single target removal, but they have gotten AoE before. I just feel like druid has gotten so much shit um, over the years. And I feel like Marco, it's aggressive, it's got AoE, it's got card draw. It doesn't have ramp, but it's just, it, it's... It's got it all. So I could buff this and take that out. And then how much mana? I have six mana left over. I could just do like this and this. Make a 3-3 three, three and then have a 1-1 one, one that I could start passing Defender off to. And that's really the only play I like. I could just play a 2-2, two, two, like make this a 3-3 three, three and a 4-4, four, four, but then I'm not answering that. I mean, that's not bad, though. Or I could just play Jonah. Swiftly now. F. No harm. Not so sure I like that. Maybe a two, a three, three, and a four, four is better than this. But I got to take out the wall. I don't know. But again, in parallel, right? Like I've got two defenders on the board. So if they want to go attempt to trade the, their three, two into my one, one, I can choose to block with my four, eight. I honestly. Don't even know that reference. I, I maybe I'm too innocent. I'm I don't I don't even I don't even understand what you're trying to say with that. I I, I don't get it. All right. Um, we're gonna accept that. What does it mean? I have no idea either. I don't know what it means. Uh, am I just accepting that? I guess so. Yeah, why well, wouldn't I get, keep my 1-1 one, one alive? Oh, because this thing, yeah, what is this? This is the death rattle aftermath. Deal damage equal to this unit's attack target enemy unit. Um, no, I think I'm gonna let that get cleared. Because maybe they have a... Maybe they have a, uh, like, PS8 launcher or something. That's what that card is. Or a two-mana deal three, and now it's awkward for them. And this is, again, deal the deal damage equal to this unit's attack. So that's going to be able to deal three damage to something. Okay, so I could bank this, play the two twos. Nah. I think I'm just going to attempt to play Tain. I like, don't usually do that against Earthen, but... Two 
and I cannot travel both. So, I am called upon. So, I trade there. They get to deal three to something. I trade here. Does it matter which way I trade? Swiftly now. Base? Clear it? I guess clear it. Never mind. She calls you back. She calls. If they have the shadow flame play here, okay. Yeah, I mean we just I might have messed up the placement there, actually. This thing has decay, so it's going to deal damage to itself and to something next to it. I guess I should have put that next to Jonah or something. Uh, that's fine. Uh, okay, well, I go here. They get to deal three damage to probably my six one. Versus if I go here and here, they could still target that and I have to leave that off. Uh, that's fine. Let's try this way. The overgrowth. I have not done much damage to them, but now I have a chonky board, so. So did when did Fabian and Charlotte marry? <laughs> it's cute that you're calling her Charlotte. Um Marissa. Her last name, yeah. Um Marissa and Fabi unfortunately did not get married. Don't tell him. It's fine. Yeah, so this is the power of Tain, right? It's his aftermath creates a shallow grave, which is a relic that just keeps bringing him back each turn. So if you're playing against Shroud, like Shroud has Banish, which essentially poofs the board, right? So it doesn't trigger um, death rattle effects, but Tain's pretty annoying. But the thing is they could just have relic destruction, right? So, um, <laughs> just kill him, Ellie. Do we have shit in here? Overgrowth. Sure. Probably super unnecessary to even do that. Do I want to play this? You know what? There's literally no point. Let's just hold it back. Wait, is it that... Mar Fabi always had a crush on Marissa, and, and Nick always had a crush on Claire. Um... Gotta get out of the light fire. Scratch. Noah, back to back. Alright, shuffle. Him. Uh, yes. But no, Marissa and Fabia unfortunately did not. What the fuck is that? Earthbreaker cannon gains shielded. With the assault, after friendly a f another friendly vehicle enters the field, Earth Breaker Cannon deals five damage to any target. Okay, I've not played with this. Let's get out of here. The name Charlotte. I'm very sure. I mean, Charlotte is in her name, so you're not you're not completely wrong.